Yeah, bowling to Kish Patel. Kish Patel's made some good uh, starts. Oh, this one. Well, Davinda, we said he could hit the ball. This one's gone all the way over square leg. Oh, the lights are on. There's no one home. No one back there for the Kings. And Maximo, six runs. What a great start. Sups in the air. It's a chance for the fielder. Oh, and he takes it. It's no more than Islam. And we just talked about Davinda. Well, he got one going. Unfortunately, this time, not quite getting the contact that he hoped for. You see that's slightly edgy. Oh, this one, it's up and away. That could go all the way, and it does. All the way over cover. Beautiful shot by Karen Dutta. That's a maximo and important runs for Ravel Sporting. Yeah, it was a lot of width on this, and uh, what helped this shot was the bounce. Well, I'll tell you what, this one, this is going to go very, very high, and in fact, it's gone very, very long. It's all the way over the fence. That one's feeding the snakes, and Kish Patel is off with that. That's a big maximo over square leg. Yeah, and you can see there straight away the big man, Kish Patel, this time he goes, and this is going to be long and strong. It's going to be all the way. Another Maximo. This time he goes offside, and Kish Patel is away. Yeah, again, just slightly short, and he was so quick to latch onto this. Watch this. Yes, thank you. I'll have it. Last ball of the over. It's Dutter on strike, and he'll be satisfied with a single one. No, no, if he'll get there. In fact, he's run himself out, the captain. Oh, he's disgusted with himself, isn't he? Isn't he? I mean, there was no need for it at all. Send another right-hander out just to keep that difference on there rather than have two the same out there? It's a good question. Well, that might solve the problem as you <laughs> see Manwani. Well, the first one snuck past the stumps, but this time it was only going one way. And Manwani trying expansive stroke. He'll have to go for only one. And Sporting losing another wicket. Trying to defend them in the second half of this match. Here's Aminal. This one goes up. Oh, the field has got a chance. Almost. A good effort by Sakeem Muhammad, but that's all the way over the top. Six runs, another Maximo. And Kish Patel, well, he's not going to slow down. Six more to him. Doing some great things also there. Lamunga the Lord's promotion, or charity drive, I should say. Well, this is up in the air, and it should be caught. Who's there? Anybody home? And it's taken, and it's the captain. As that one's gone straight up in the air. And you worried for a second that they were going to leave it for each other, but then the captain, well, he's got a safe pair of hands. Yeah. This is going to be four runs. Yeah, it was short on the legs, and we've seen it before. Not a good line from the bowler. And freebies for the batsman. Yeah, absolutely. And Das. This time he goes aerial. He's going to get through the gap. Those two men patrolling the point region. Well, they tried their best, but both of them could only watch on as that one went through the gap. Four runs and a valuable boundary for Ravel Sporting. They'll finish the over. 74 for four. This is short, and he's gone after it between the two fielders in fact it might have gone all the way it might have just carried the rope it is it's a maximo and valuable runs for Ravel Sporting at the back end of this innings yeah Muman Ali try to reply to the bowler this one's up it's in the air Moynal thought he was in the game we did everything he could but it's over the top of him over the top of the boundary and back to back maximals for Ravel Sporting and Muman Ali well now he's taken out the long handle here in the ninth over Oh, and this has completely fooled him. He's going to be gone. Yeah. I think it's probably... Well, we'll have to see what the final decision is there. That 50-50 could have been stumped or run out. He was looking for a run in the end, so it's probably run out. You yeah, see he's, run out there. he's gone, taken a couple of steps forward. Bang, it's gone high. It's gone very, very high. Well, the field, this is going to take some catching. And in the end, he's going to have to come back for two. Surely there's a run out here, and there will be. So it'll be one and a wicket off the last ball. And so the total for Ravels... After their turnovers, they are 97 for the loss of six. You know that the batsman's got to move his feet. He's got to come out to this ball. Oh, and that one just... Maybe just ended up more towards the legs and the batsman able. Deep, that good square leg, and that one's gone. He sent that one parking. Doesn't matter where those two men are because that's cleared everything. Six runs, and that's a super shot from Sufikul Islam. Next one's a slow ball. Hit down the ground. He's going to have to go the other way now. Date has got the chase on. On oh, this time, he can't quite do it. He went with the fancy footwork. That time, not as effective as his effort the last ball. Here's the last ball of the over. Oh, it's a Spanish drive. That's going to be inside edge. Could go all the way. 
And it beats the fielder down there. So a fortunate boundary. We've seen some nice strokes. This one was all luck, though. And Sakeem Muhammad, big swing, just getting the right angle unintentionally down to that fine leg boundary. So that's the end of the second over, Bangladesh Kings. And he's done it again. And would you believe it? Our Sonny Jangra, we saw him hit this up seven times on Wednesday, and he's getting in on the act, his 10th wicket of the tournament. And this one, well, just been a little bit of a quiet period for the Kings. This one is going to evade the fine leg field. That was slightly outside leg stump. And a nice shot by Shaquille Mia, who's come in at number three. So he's immediately away with a boundary. And he's got the wicket and he's done it again. The little maestro. Well, he's conducting from the bowling crease. And this one was tossed up. And he took the bait, didn't he, Sakeem Muhammad? And he's done it again, Sonny Jungra. Well, unbelievable work. That's the ninth time that he has hit the timber in this fan code European cricket series. And this time it was the middle stump. Jangra doing it again for Ravel Sporting. What a beauty of a delivery that was. Oh, and he's done it again. This time he was assisted by an inside edge, but the stumps go down. Oh, and it's his 10th bold dismissal. Sonny Jangra, we're going to have to start handing out the man of the match awards before the match. And he does exactly that, the little maestro. He's done it again. And the fifth bold dismissal in the innings. And again, this time, it's Moshi Rahman, the big wicket of the captain. And he's upset with himself. Munal Islam has come out to face the last ball of Maya Vanshi. And he's done it once again. Can you believe it? <laughs> Seeing is believing. And Goran Mayavanshi, well, it's a socially distant celebration, but an enthusiastic one nonetheless. He, well, he can't be on a hat trick because he's bowled out his two overs, but he'll nonetheless be very, very happy. This time, there's a lot of bat on it, but there's a fielder down there, and he takes it. Oh, he's everywhere at the moment. There's Mayavanshi at third man, and we haven't seen too many catches in that region. But obviously, it was a good field placing. Oh, and there we go. That's right on the money. And it, this is good for Manish Mawani. He's struggled, hasn't he, with bat and with ball. We've seen him spray the ball all over the place as well. When he's coming to bowl, he's struggled. Sometimes full tosses, not getting it on the mat. And he's come on and bowled here. Well, this one's gone very, very high. Is there anyone home? It's the bowler. And he holds on. Masood. Well, he's brought on. You said how important the ninth over was. And Dawood Masood. It was well bowled, it went very high in the air. He took responsibility, took the catch. Well, this one's flicked away nicely. I think this will be four. This is well timed by the batsman. So it's a little bit too little, too late, you'd have to say, but nice finish to the over. The Kings. This is up, and this could be the end of the match. Masood's underneath it. And he's grabbed it in the left hand. Well, go, go, gadget. And Masood finishes this game. Bowling out the Bangladesh Kings. And, well, we've seen some one-handed catches in the outfield. We've seen some highlights. What a highlight this was by Dawood Masood.